Hi, I'm working on a Rochester 2-Jet, that's a two-barrel carburetor. And I'm going to tell you about the power circuit on these things. The uh, starts with this uh, stem here, and it's spring-loaded, and it's, there, it's just a brass piston that goes inside here. Okay, and uh, when you take it out, when you clean it, just buff it off and uh, make sure your hole is clean. There's also a little hole right here, it's a relief hole and uh, I've gone, I've taken silicon and spray lubricant and sprayed through there to get it cleaned out uh, but it's got to move very easily up and down, okay? Alright, so what happens is at idle uh, at low speed and idle, it, the vacuum is the strongest in your carburetor and it pulls down that stem and holds it down and then as you give it some power it loses vacuum and it goes down and it pushes in on this stem right here on your power jet and the stem as it's pushed down allows fuel to flow through here you can see the bottom opening up here and allows extra fuel to flow into the uh, main area here where the jets are it mixes with the other fuel and goes up to your venturi where it mixes with the uh, air okay and into the bore but that's how it works so the main thing is to make sure that the stem is is uh, nice and clean and loose we do carry these by the way and uh, this power valve we carry that um, there's a couple of different sizes this is fits almost all the two jets up until the late 70s I believe uh, and it's like a 5 16th thread I think and the later ones are a bigger thread 3 8 so that's it that's how your power circuit works